my name is Alex Cecilio. I'm a graphic artist, and I'm going to show you how to make a typographic portrait in Photoshop. So I have my text here that I'm going to use. So I'm going to go ahead and just make a text layer over my entire image. And I'm going to paste um, my artist biography. And I'm going to do it a couple of times. And the reason I'm doing that is because with a typographic portrait like this, you're going to really want a lot of text to cover the area because when you create a clipping mask, um, it's going to it's gonna get rid of any text that isn't showing where the white is. So ideally you want it to be over, like I want it to be over where my glasses are and where the hair is. So I'm just going to keep doing, I'm going to do a couple of layers of text. The reason I'm also doing a couple of layers is so I can have different colors as well. And I'm going to keep locking them so I don't accidentally activate them. Like so. And then I'm going to do some more typing. Um, so I'm gonna whoop, gonna move that. Okay, and then I'm gonna just do one more type layer. Okay, just finished here. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to combine these layers by clicking the top layer, holding shift, and clicking the bottom text layer, right clicking, oh, and since they're all locked, make sure to unlock them, otherwise you can't edit them. Oops. Okay, Rast and then you can right click and rasterize type. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly go over each text layer with a gradient. So I'm going to go to the bottom to FX per layer, and then I'm going to do gradient overlay. And this is going to give you the option to add gradient color to your image. Um, and I actually don't want that color. I'll just do it really dark. Okay, so then I'm going to just do that each time, each layer. You can play around with the gradient colors. So I'm going to keep doing this with colors that I like. And right now I'm just selecting the presets like that. And I'm actually going to, you can copy your layer style by right clicking, select copy layer style, go to the next layer, and then paste layer style. You can even go back in and edit, you know, where your gradient meshes. Okay, so now we've got the color that we need. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to merge these layers by holding down shift and clicking all of them, or just by clicking one and then holding shift and clicking the last one. Right click, and then I'm actually going to merge layers. So now they're all one layer. Double click your background to unlock it so that it's editable. Go on top, put it on top as your top layer. And then in your layer opacity options, go down to screen so that it shows through. And then the last thing you're gonna do is right click and create a clipping mask. And then this last layer, I'm just gonna put a little bit of white 
so that way you can see my image. And there you have your typographic portrait. My name is Alex and this is how you make a typographic portrait in Photoshop. Thank you.